Welcome to today's episode with Bit by Day. Today, we'll be venturing into the fascinating world of tokens and the process of tokenization within the blockchain ecosystem. Tokens are more than just digital currencies, they're the lifeblood of decentralized networks, offering a diverse range of functionalities. Imagine a bustling marketplace powered by blockchain technology. Tokens act as digital keys that unlock specific features and services within this marketplace. These tokens are meticulously crafted and managed through smart contracts, residing securely on blockchain platforms. This allows them to represent a vast array of assets, rights, and utilities, effectively bridging the gap between the physical and digital worlds. Let's delve deeper into the two primary categories of tokens utility tokens and security tokens, utility tokens are at the heart of many blockchain-based applications. These tokens provide access to specific functionalities or services within a blockchain ecosystem. They are instrumental in enabling the operation of decentralized applications, dApps, and are often required to pay for transaction fees or computational resources. For instance, on the Ethereum network, Ether, ETH, serves as a utility token necessary for executing smart contracts. Utility tokens empower developers and users to participate in, interact with, and contribute to blockchain ecosystems. Security tokens are a bridge between traditional finance and the blockchain world. They represent real-world assets, such as equities, real estate, or bonds, on a blockchain. By digitizing these assets, security tokens offer benefits like increased liquidity, fractional ownership, and enhanced transparency. Unlike utility tokens, security tokens are subject to regulatory compliance. Security token offerings, STOs, provide a legally compliant framework for issuing these tokens and ensure that investors receive the necessary ownership rights or financial dividends. Now let's take a look at tokenization. Tokenization is a transformative process that allows traditional assets to be represented as digital tokens. This process offers immense benefits, including increased accessibility and liquidity of assets that were traditionally illiquid. For instance, real estate properties can be tokenized, enabling investors to buy and trade fractions of a property. Tokenization has the potential to revolutionize various industries, including real estate, art, and even intellectual property, by making them more easily tradable and divisible. I am sure by now you will be wondering what the difference are between these two categories of tokens. Distinguishing between utility tokens and security tokens is paramount for compliance and regulatory adherence. The classification hinges on the token's purpose and its relationship to ownership and investment. While utility tokens are used to access services and utilities within a blockchain network, security tokens represent ownership or investment in an underlying asset or venture. It's important to acknowledge these distinctions to navigate the evolving legal landscape governing the issuance and trading of tokens. Initial Coin Offerings ICOs, ICOs have been a driving force in token issuance and fundraising for blockchain projects. For starters, they allow startups to raise capital by selling tokens to investors. However, the ICO landscape has undergone significant changes due to regulatory concerns. Many early ICOs faced scrutiny for potential fraud or lack of investor protection. This led to increased attention from regulatory bodies. As a response, security token offerings, STOs, have emerged as a more regulated fundraising method that complies with securities regulations. In conclusion, tokens are versatile digital assets that extend beyond serving as a form of digital currency. Utility tokens grant access to blockchain services. While security tokens represent ownership rights in real-world assets, tokenization transforms traditional assets into blockchain-compatible forms, expanding liquidity and accessibility. Understanding these concepts is vital for projects, investors, and regulators navigating the complex and evolving landscape of token-based offerings and cryptocurrencies. Thank you for watching today's episode. 
I hope you found the video informative and enjoyable. If you have any questions or feedback, please feel free to leave a comment below. Don't forget to like and subscribe for more content like this. Your support is greatly appreciated.